What is going on, guys? Today, we have got 97 moments Richarlison for you. If you're tired of... You're tired of coming up against teams that want to rip your hair out every single day. Make sure you check u7buy.com for the most reliable and cheapest coins on the market. And at checkout, make sure you hit that JT11 for 5% off your order. And hopefully, you have a good day. So a very easy SBC to complete. An 88 rated team and an 83. No chem required. Just absolutely easy. So, we have got a 4 star, 5 star. was kind of hoping he would have been 5-5 five, five being Brazilian. So we'll just have a quick look to see if that is uh, in fact right or if that is a visual glitch. I don't... Yeah, he's not even on foot bin yet. Okay, so we'll have a look at that in a second. He might be a 5-5. Five, five. It might be just a 4-5. Four, uh, four, so we'll see how that goes once he's been updated. But he is 5'11". He has transferred now into Tottenham and another good Brazilian card. Pace maxed out. Shooting pretty much maxed out. Good passing. Great dribbling. Um, heading accuracy is 99. And the physicality is incredible. So again, a very, very solid card to finish off the, the kind of game. I'm surprised he's not actually on footbin at all because we could have looked at anything else in terms of chemistry style because really, you don't need any more pace. Shooting-wise, a 2-plus on, uh, on the finishing is not going to make a difference. His dribbling, again, everything else is pretty nice. You could go for a bit more balance maybe, but again, it's really not going to make too much of a difference. I think basic could just be the way to go with him. We will detail all that at the end when, obviously, he has been updated into footbin. He's got flair and power header. We're going to jump him into the team and just give him a go. Everybody has God squads. Honestly, we've just got the 85 times 10 repeatable, so that should be, again, a nice, easy thing to do. Finally, we have got it for the last couple of weeks, so it'll be interesting to see... If anybody grinds it out, we will be doing a video on it, just having a look at what we can basically do now in terms of finishing off everything and what's basically left to do in this game. As we follow Richarlison here, good dribbling. In fact, I want to see them free kicks because I didn't actually see it. I know we've got a lot of good free kick takers and he's not in the top, <laughs> the top section, so that must mean... Free kick accuracy 83, it's not going to be the best in terms of what we actually expect from our free kick takers, we get the green, and it's a good save from Pope. Into Richarlison again, he's looking for the options. We're going to go for that finesse. You know we've got to go for it, and I'm very, very unlucky. He's going to be that sort of striker that, that can hit the ball from anywhere. Finishing is is pretty much maxed out. And again, with, with these kind of game, uh, players now coming out, they are the elite of the elite. They're the end game cards. You're not going to see them any other point of the game, because what's the point? If we had 97, 98 in literally March, there's just no point. Great ball across. Plus as well, oh, that's a good interception. The SBCs as well with the no chemistry is actually really, really helpful. So we may be able to do something with a lot of icon moments with this repeatable. So that'll be interesting as well as we try and make the block. And we do get it out. Can we get this counter with Richarlison? Going to look for that Neymar over the top. And I don't know why he went for, for Salah. The good thing as well with Richarlison is he's going to give us great game throughout. Good passing. He's obviously got the height. He's got the shooting. The physicality's there. Heading's there. He is the, the out-and-out striker that you need next to somebody like a Neymar or like a Messi. Because he will give you pretty much what no other striker will. He's just not quite found the back of the net yet. But in terms of kind of what, what you want from a striker, he has everything. He's got the pace. He's got just what you need in terms of a top-end sort of striker. The only thing I kind of want is that 5-5. Five five. We're still waiting for him to be updated. Hopefully, it will be soon, and we will see if there is any visual glitch, and hopefully there is. Oh, he finds him. That's a solid block from Varane. He definitely would have got the goal with that through ball, and he finds a great through ball in himself. Richarlison finds Messi in. He's going to... Do the little double dummy, and he's not fell for it in the slightest. Oh, he finds him. Oh, it's beautiful. What an assist. Sometimes it's not about the goals. It's what he can do with it. Gets the head. Ah, just not quite there. There's the ball. It's going to absolutely skip past him. Gets it onto his right foot, and it's a solid save from Courtois. Denying Richarlison once more. Into Richarlison. Gets the physicality battle won. 
There it is, little spin across, and again, another assist. It's just so, so simple with these sorts of players. So as we can't really show you anything in terms of Footbin, they haven't actually updated their system, and same with Footwatch and obviously Foot.gg. We're going to just go back to the stats and just talk briefly about what we kind of know with Richarlison and what he's kind of good with. We will swap this back so we show you what the 100 chem looks like. In terms of the basic, we get the agility up to 99. We get 99 ball control, uh, short passes there, long pass with a little bit of extra, and we get a bit more of a, st uh, a strength boost. Nothing really too crazy, but the stats are already in the 99s pretty much so there's not really a lot else you can do with it the goals he can score is always nice he's got the ability on the pitch he's what 5 5 11 nice height he's definitely got a lean body type or at least a body type that enables him to be as fast as what 99 kind of suggests passing wise it's very nice his dribbling's good I definitely think the physicality side is something that you will really like in comparison to a lot of the players that we've got. Neymar, not necessarily the strongest on the ball. Same with Messi. Salah, I think, was a bit of an unusual one because at times he does feel really strong on the ball and he can hold off. But then there is games where I just he just doesn't do it. Rashford, obviously, very similar to Richarlison. We then have somebody like Ginola, very, very similar, as you can see. Pace is all up there, shooting, passing, dribbling, physicality. Very, very similar to that sort of card. But obviously, with Ginola, he is the 5-5. So, I'm led to believe he is 4-5. It hasn't changed yet. Again, if it does and if he is meant to be a 5-5, then unfortunately, we haven't got that uh, kind of information as of right now. But what a card. Very easy to complete. A nice card to get into your club. Another massive rating into the, into the, uh, into the growing aspect of everybody as well. So can't argue with him. Must do. Let me know down below what you think. And I'll catch you all for the next one. Pieces.